Hey guys, it's Mike. This week we have a throwback to the origin of this podcast. Sung and I used to have a radio show in high school named We Don't Know What We're Talking About. And since we couldn't get together this week, we've decided to release one of those episodes instead. This episode is from May 19th, 2008. It features four special guests, George, Cody, Wes, and Jen. I hope you enjoy. All right, we're back. Welcome hey. back. Don't you to Washington. You're listening to Sung. And Buddha. We don't know why we're no. talking. No, we don't. No, we don't. No. We don't. no, we don't. no. Hi, hi, Buddha. How are you? I'm good. How are you, Sung? I am... Super? No. Yes? No, I'm... Yes? Kind of like... No. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know what I'm doing. We don't know what we're talking about. Yeah. But we're back in... Oh! Oh! I, I haven't listened to this song for forever. I like this song. You don't like this song? No, I like this song. I like this song. Yeah. Everybody does. Yeah. I kind of wake up an hour ago. So I don't, I don't, I have no idea what's going on. We have, by the way, we have George and Cody in the other room. Hey guys. Yeah. Right. So, so, here's the deal. You guys gonna feel all the best things, alright? Start from now, talk. So, how are the SATs, George? As usual, they're horrible. Don't, don't take the SATs. Yeah, George is, wait a minute, you actually study for SAT? Yeah, I have to take the SAT too. SATs That's are true. evil. They really are. I'm not gonna lie. They're not, they're not even necessary. Wesley have good stories Just put SAT, everyone down. Right? They really Horrible. Do, no? they, they offend me in many ways. You gotta like get a low score. Hey like, Wes, what did you get on the SAT? Conversations. And you didn't study? Oh, <laughs> George is like, he's punching him today. Why? What you got last time? I studied for many hours. Many, many hours, hours. Many I hours. Did. And what you got? This I is the first time or? First time. I first time is always hard. I, I get my score this, this Wednesday, but I'm pretty sure I didn't even break 2,000. It's, I hate life. Don't feel bad, man. I, I, didn't, I didn't even break the 1,000. <laughs> So, what's up with you guys? Did anyone watch the new Narnia movie? No. Actually, my theater got the Narnia, but I don't like Narnia. I like the book, but I don't like the movie. First one was like, yeah. Second one was like, yeah. They're going to make third one? How many is they going to make? Seven. I would rather watch... There's seven? No. 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 The second one just came out. I would rather watch... Uh, Batman. That ba- yes. Dark yeah. Knight. Do you, yes. July 18th. Do you know they made Joker action figures and they're selling out completely? Yeah, selling out. they're sold out. Yeah, they're like four hundred dollars on eBay now. That's that's ridiculous. Like, that figure doesn't even look like his Ledger. Doesn't. <laughs> no, doesn't. Doesn't look like this. Yeah, but still, it's memorabilia and it's quite nice. Like, I must say. Did you get one? No. Yeah. I, I'm not that rich, I'm sorry. <laughs> How much is it? Uh, 400 just, on eBay. Yeah, you just said it. No way! What am I, is it like limited version or like... They're just like regular action figures. I mean like, they're pretty cool looking because it has like that gruesome look to like, how, the how big Joker. Is it? Like, 8 inches, 8 and a half inches. Oh. It's... Wow. Yeah. Seriously, yeah. would you pay, pay $400 no, that's ridiculous. for that? There's some crazy people. I'll, system, I'll make know. one by myself with a soap. <laughs> <laughs> that's good. Yeah, I can, I can wash my hand too. It's made out of soap. Yeah, you're a crazy person. Face. Right? Would you pay four hundred dollars? Ridiculous. Yeah, it really it's is. Just a yeah. plastic toy. Yeah. And you sell for four hundred. And people who buy it, they don't do anything. They leave it on a shelf. Kids should be like the ones who should have it. Like they play around. Like they. Like little yeah, stupid things I, with them. I never got that. I see just like people who collect, you know, all these like like action figure, but they just keep them in the box, never take it out, just, just keep them in the box. I'm like, what's the point, you know? Some strange people out there, man. Yeah, that's that's very true. Would I say something? 
Buddha, you there? Buddha. Buddha's looking really good with his sunglasses today. Hey. Yeah. Buddha's the new Romeo on the radio. <laughs> what is this supposed to mean? What you don't mean? know that Z100 DJ? Romeo on the radio? No. No? Don't see 100 Oh man. Yo, I, we I should, do not. We should phone tap people. But we should make our own name. We should call it Phone Touch. <laughs> yeah, that <laughs> sounds... Get it like Phone Tap? That or Touch that's, phone. that's great. That's great. <laughs> no. <laughs> You're not very creative. Of course. Yeah, sorry. Phone fondling. Ah, right, bro. What's going on right now? Like phone touch, like oh, no, get it, like a phone tap. Just, just double click. Are we recording? Yeah. Yes, we are. Oh wow. <laughs> Last show was horrible. What happened? There was I don't know. Were, were you here, George? Freshmen were here. Everyone here. Yeah. Oh no, that's, that's why. That's why it was bad. Yeah, it was really bad. It was. It was horrible. Yeah. It's like next. Yeah. I don't like this song. The next one. Yeah, we only stuck on one song, and that was the German one. Then everything else, like we went halfway through. Yeah, All right, I, I think I think we should make a mutual agreement. Freshmen have no opinion in this room, no matter what. Do you guys agree? We should uh, we should torture them <laughs> with a with a cup and a cat on a stick. Hot wax. Pretty, it's pretty weird. <laughs> Hot wow. wax. <laughs> what is that? A cat on the you know, tie it like a some rabid cat on a stick and like poke them with it. <laughs> they scratch your face all up. That was really good. <laughs> it was really good, Fred. Was it? We're back. Hey. I just I just erased a whole bunch of clip. I didn't even go through. <laughs> all right. Whatever. Whatever. All right, so. What is this song? I don't know. It's pretty cool. Winter by Trans-Siberian Orchestra. Yes. <laughs> How do you know that? I've heard it before. Oh, Jen is here too. It sounds really nice. Hi, Jen. Mm. Hello, Jen. How are you? Good. You should talk to the mic. Oh, oh yeah. It's like good. miles away from me. <laughs> we can hear you. Uh, now, now say something. No. Hi. Hi. Jen, did you hear the Bax new album coming out this July? This July? Mm-hmm. Yeah, this July. I didn't know it was July, but I knew it was going to be in the summer. Yeah. Jin? Oh yes, I am very excited. Oh, it's gonna be the red album, right? Yes. Yes. Wow, without headphones, it's so awkward. Like, I can't do without music. Just stand there. Wow. You're like, wow, what's next? Alright, so what? You wanna play something? No, he's too busy. <laughs> well, if you don't want to, you don't really have to. Do you want to play? Liar. All right, George, Cody, feel. What? I'm Phil. out. Of, I'm out of topic. I don't know what to. I don't know. I don't know what to say. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Feel. Talk about giraffe. All right. So you giraffe. guys. Giraffe. Yes. Giraffe. 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 Long necks. Giraffe. And they look. <gasps> Weird. Have you ever heard the promo for our show? Yeah, I heard it. George? I didn't. I'd like to hear it. You know what? I'm gonna put it right now. Thank you. What is that? It's techno. I heard that from a movie once. What movie? Shh. The name is inappropriate over the radio. Oh yeah, don't say it. Shh. Song. Hi, I'm Buddha. You're listening to. We don't know what no. we're talking about. We have no idea what no, we're we talking don't. about. That's that's well, come that's join the us. whole concept of the show. Yeah. Throughout the whole show, we just don't know what we're talking about. We just talk about the random thing. We talk about. We talk about draft. We talk about monkey.
Yeah, that was it. I liked your choice of music. Yep. Yes, yes. <laughs> Mr. Clap asked me, which song you wanna <laughs> put on the background? And, and I said, there's only one song. There's only one song we're gonna do it. And it's gonna be the Ghostbusters. I think that was a smart choice. I know. Undoubtedly. Kinda smart. Kinda very smart. And then we actually did it right after the. As soon as we finished the last show, Mr. Clav came here and then we just. Let's do it. Let's do this. And we just, we just did it. What? Did I say? Did you say? Hey, what was it? What was it? What's his gun? What's his gun? You know what? So I'm gonna just do it by myself. West has All left time. the building. You, who right, oh, do it? Who that will play bongo? I'll play bongo. Okay. I'll play guitar. I don't know how to play. Sweet. I don't know how to play bongos, but I'll play. Try. Sexy. Love Zoo and hate. Oh, yo, guys. Yeah. Oh, actually, no. Okay. Sorry. <laughs> you might have to read the paragraph. Last time I played just original throughout the whole show. It's a bad word. So today, I actually. Paragraph. Cover. Stop it. <laughs> what are you playing? We are gonna play cover. Oh, what song? It's called "I'm Only Sleeping" by the Beatles. Oh, the Beatles. The make Beatles. me proud, song. Make me proud. I don't know the song. Everybody, I'll no. Make, I'll make yeah. it up as I go. Yes. I'll go. Can you play the Beatles bit? No. <laughs> Wait, let me turn my guitar.
<laughs> Good job. All right. I tried my best. Sounds amazing. I love the part when the, they where they actually have the backup vocal on the chorus and they go like on the chorus like please don't stop my day. They they do like. Not have back and forth here. Buddha used to be. Buddha used to be back and forth for the. If I knew the song, I would have done that for the Kafka. For temporary. Blue donut. And he got fired. Hey, <laughs> hey, hey, hey! I didn't get fired. You kicked me out. Isn't it? Don't Just worry, like Buddha. We we love you, Buddha. Actually, no. I didn't get kicked out. The band broke up. Yeah, we broke up. And then they just didn't invite me back. Where no. did the love go? Love. Yeah. What kind of love you're talking about? The lovely kind. There's a lot of different kind of love, love in the world, you know? Like, okay. such as... Animal love? <laughs> Interspecies erotica. <laughs> oh, yeah! You watched the first two. That was a great movie, by the way. Yes. First two. Jay and Solomon Bob. I was like... I have no idea, you know, like, they're gonna make the second movie, because I thought that after Jay and Silent Bob strike back, they they said they, he'll never, Kevin Smith, said he'll never ever make another movie with the Jay and Silent Bob. Really? Yeah. Well, that movie wasn't that great, um, Jay and Silent Bob strike back. It's very cheesy. It wasn't anything that... It was just straight comedy. Yeah. It's like, I like, I like Club first, of course. Mollet? Mollet, that was good. Mollet is classic. Classic. I love it. Um, Dogma. Dogma. Dogma is hilarious. Yeah, that I was a it. long one, too. That was, I think it was like his longest movie. Mm -hmm. Like two and a half hours. Pretty funny, though. By Kevin Smith? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but with the Chris Rock and everything. Yeah. Yeah, they also, uh, what was it? The other one, he has something about Amy. That was his other one. Chasing Amy. Chasing Amy. Chasing Amy was really was good, it? too. It's not, it wasn't the comedy, but uh, I mean, I'm a huge fan of Jason Lee, so. Buddha's keep putting techno. I love me my techno. I can imagine you in the techno club, George. With no, your I, I really like techno. Neon with those sticks. Yeah, yeah, Buddha, put on Sandstorm. Psst. Sandstormed in your face. <laughs> I should put on my song. Your song? Oh yeah, totally man. Actually Buddha came by to work stuff. Came by the basement of the Kafka studio yesterday. Right? We actually jammed together and uh, Buddha played bass. I, I played guitar. In my, I have the CD in my car. <laughs> yeah, you oh, should it's blocked. You should totally bring it. What, what are you looking for? The song I showed you yesterday. Oh. Wow, we only did 18 minutes for the show. And now I'm, now I'm totally out of stuff to talk about. What should we talk about? So, um, do you guys know that Iron Man is the best superhero movie ever created? That w it Don't was say really good. About it, though, so it was brilliant. Seen it. You haven't seen it? You haven't well, seen it? See it? Who did it? Jack? Oh, I'm gonna spoil it so bad. All right, did you guys oh, no. see the <laughs> okay. secret shit of oh, the, the the ending thing in the credits? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah I saw yeah. a lot of people just leave like after that. Like, yeah, but I did actually stay till for yeah. that scene. I, I'm I'm ashamed to say that I left right after the credits. <gasps> oh, and you just say it was the best superhero movie ever. It was. Well, I, I watched the ending what online. What kind of so. Best superhero movie ever was Batman Begins. That was amazing. Yeah, it was. It, no, I kind of have to I'm agree. Not gonna, I'm not gonna admit it was good, but I think Iron Man was so much better. I'm sorry. No, no. I think it was so much better. Yeah. Different opinions. To each his own. It's really hard to pick a good, the best superhero movie because I love the Spider-Man first one. That one was okay. When it came out, come on, like, come on, like, we didn't have any. I, I, I don't think we have any, you know, good superhero movie before. Spider-Man. Yeah, no, I, there really wasn't any good. No, I, I no. really agree. Yeah, and but after that, like, boom, here's Punisher. Here's boom, here's like Superman. 
Punisher yeah, but, was horrible. I never watched Punisher. What? I I really what? I I mean I love the me? Punisher comics. Yeah, those are so cool. Yeah, but I couldn't stand the movie. It was why? Like, cause John Tobolta? No, no, no. That he was okay in it, but it was like, like the little things in it. Like yeah, if you just like watch it, you can see so many bad things that happen. Like you know the part. When they're at the top of the build, like he's at the top of the building and he puts uh, John Travolta's son, he gives him the bomb. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Alright, like, then he goes down, like, that 20 story building and sees John Travolta. He's like, You killed my family. And then all of a sudden you hear a perfectly clear scream but, from the 20 story building. He's like, No! <laughs> now I killed your family. He's like, He's 20 stories up. You would hear, No! <laughs> That's what you would hear. You would hear, No! He's <laughs> <laughs> No! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I know what you mean, but you know, it's it's movie. Yeah. It's movie. Now they're making second one. They're, they're making second Punisher. Punisher. Are Punisher. you serious? Didn't so they make like five of them already? It's called Punisher. Are you sure? No. Origin. Oh, sorry. But no, there was actually a Punisher movie. Before really that? old one. Like, it's like made in like 1980 or something. Around that. Really old one. I saw parts of it, but... I never got to finish, but I I think it was pretty good, my memory. And then, what else is coming out? Actually, Hulk. I had Incredible Hulk. Hulk. You uh, know, the first one was absolutely horrible. Yeah, I, I honestly almost left. I disagree with you. That is one you movie like, I wish I sneaked you in. You like that one? I liked it. I I couldn't stand that. It was a really part. superhero movie, but the, I thought the like the father and son all just those you know. Yeah, that, that was, was that was really one of the good scenes of the movie, that, like the final battle. I, I I'm not gonna. Lie. Yeah, but like, the problem was they didn't put you know much the action scene like fighting scene or the yeah. monster. We kind of expect like Hulk beating the, you know. Yeah. Other villain. <laughs> I tried to. Fantastic <laughs> Four movies weren't good either. No, no, Four never talk about the Fantastic Four movies. Why? You know, even even if everything was bad, Jessica Alba made it amazing. No, that's, no, no, that's George. my boy. That's. You think down here, George, not up here. But you know, Cody, Cody, oh but if I have to pick a worst superhero movie ever, I can pick. What? Spider-Man Three. Yes, I, I agree. Horrible. They destroyed that's disgusting. Horrible. They destroyed the children. What was that emo thing that he did? He was like the jazz club. And yeah, like, uh, uh, like emo and jazz doesn't go together. First of all, Definitely okay, not. and then I don't yeah. know what what they were thinking making the movie because like we we gotta put like three like villains like uh, Venom and uh, you know like Hobgoblin uh, and the Sad Man and like uh, blah 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 and they just destroyed it. Yeah, I was very surprised too because. The director yeah, Sam Ray, he's such a great director. Like, he made the. <laughs> yeah, you know, I'm sorry. Yeah, this, the director was good and everything, but you know when he started crying at the end. What? When when Spider Man started crying at the end when. He what's cried? his face died? Yeah, when when what's his face died. Um, Henry. Yeah. Right. When the Goblin's son died. Do you remember? Yeah. Who at the end cried? The movie, right, Spider Man like, cried. When, um, uh, the the Green Goblin's son when he um he protects Spider Man from. Uh, being killed by uh, Venom, like you see, like the end with um, him and I think Mary Jane up like on that building, and he's like crying. Uh, what? So what about it, George? This is so funny. Oh, it's just fun. I was, <laughs> you go to like come to a big conclusion, just like it, like I was laughing the so hard. Didn't realize how horrible <laughs> the movie was. You were just laughing in the theater. Dude, I went to the midnight show, man. I even though I was school, I'm like I pay for the tickets and everything. Even that working movie theater, okay. And then I was like, whoa, like like before the movie started, I was like talking to my friend, like, this movie's gonna be the best. I might do something crazy middle of the movie because this movie's gonna be so great. Then like after like middle of you know the show start, I'm like, oh, what is this? All my money back. Hey song, I have a quick question. Cause don't don't you get in for free because you work at the movie theaters? Not the not the midnight show. Oh, oh not man. the that stinks. Not the special food. But you get free snacks, right? No. Oh. I get I get free popcorn. But I hate popcorn now. <laughs> Do you work in movie theater for like? Oh yeah, good point. If almost here. Yeah, if you work at any 
food establishment, you never want to eat that food ever. No, again. no, dude, man. When first time when I started, I love popcorn. Like that, that's all I had, popcorn and soda. And now I'm like sick of it. I'm like, the other day I was very hungry, and my friends were like, I, I was talking to my friend, and like, dude, I'm so hungry. He's like, oh, why don't you grab some popcorn? I'm like, no. <laughs> I'd rather bite my tongue and kill myself. <laughs> Popcorn. You, you feel very passionately about this, don't you? What? You feel very passionately about this, don't you? Yes. Yes, I am. Uh, Song, when you work in the movie theaters, how many times have you had to uh, get a what is it, a soda slug out of the drains? What? You know the soda slugs? Yeah. yeah. Uh, how many have you ever taken out? Answer truth, truthfully now. I can't, I can't, can't remember. It was a little. What was it like? A lot of them? Yeah, a lot. Did it ever like make you like never want to drink soda again because of how weird it was? You get sick of it. You get sick of everything after a while, you know. It's true. I like oh, that. What happened to the racing game at the movie theater? It said it was out of order. Yeah, that movie break down like every once in a while, I don't I, know why. I was, I was getting too many high scores. You know what happened <laughs> one time? We put the out of order sign on the, on the screen, right? Mm -hmm. And these parents came up to the box office later. They're like, the machine ate my quarters. <laughs> I'm like, ma'am, didn't you read the sign and say out of order? It's like, no, but I thought it would work if I put quarters in. <laughs> like, we, we turn up. What is that? High School. That was amazing. What? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm like, did you write the sign? It's out of order. We, we, we unplugged the, like everything and, and, and she put the quarters and now she wants the money back. I'm like, wow. 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 That's something. Actually, if you work in like movie theater or like like anywhere like like home goods stop and shop, you see a lot of not smart smart people. people. You mean idiots? I'm not sure we can say that on the radio. I apologize. <laughs> Don't cry. Are you crying? Wipe those sand off your eyes. Are, are you crying, George? <laughs> Why do not send? Uh, I love Sorry, you. Sorry, George, I love you. Still busy? Glass with your tears. American right. Idol? I never watched American Idol. Oh, it's the finale. It. It's the finale this week. It's between um, mm -hmm. it's between yeah. wh who was it? Dan Cook and this other guy. Did you just say Dane Cook? No, Dan Cook? Dan Cook. And what? I only know the names because I keep seeing it online. I'm oh. yeah. I was gonna say, George. It, it's a little kid who doesn't even deserve to be there. It's like, uh, yeah, something like that. I don't know. Seems like Jenna has something to say. Talk to the microphone. I can't really hear you. Say it and say it, pal. Alright, you know what? I'll give you five minutes. You're gonna feel the five minute from now, Jen. Start from now. Yes. Go. Yes. Go. Go. Feel. You're gonna feel the five minute. No, no one's gonna talk. No music. No, no music, no nothing. It's just you. Five minutes. I'll give you five minutes. Say whatever you want. Ready? Go. Three, two, one. Go. Go. Why? I am talking? Yes. Why? Yes. Five yes. minutes. Five why, minutes. Why am I supposed to talk for five minutes? I don't know. You seems like you have something to say. In your, no, I, I don't. I, I can read your face. I have no opinions. I have nothing to say. What kind of TV shows do you like? What is this now, an interview? <laughs> what kind of TV show? Right. What is your policy on child labor? <laughs> <laughs> That's a good question. Put some good music in the background. It's on Sandstorm. It's my favorite Tekken song. If I had it, I would. Sorry. This is Croatia, you know that?
Deliverance. Oh. Circle round and dozy doze. Hey ha! <laughs> Fine. You never talk to that. Shh. You never ever talk. I'm not here. You know what? I quit. You, you're gonna feel all this from Bye. now. I quit. Let's see. Hey Wes. Hi. How are you? I'm wonderful. How's the band? Doing good. Awesome. Yeah. When's your next show? Never, I hope. How's the bus? Good. You should talk about Doris the Kafka bus. Doris the Kafka bus. Doris the Kafka bus. Doris is a wonderful bus. And uh... She, she's very interesting. She's actually half red and half black. It's very, it's a very diverse bus and interracial. Oh, wait, this music's turning me on. But something else. Like it. And uh, she's really big on the inside. There's a lot of room in there. You could fit like six people in. There. And, like, Can't wait to <laughs> sleep uh, inside of her. You could sleep. They actually, the people we bought her from. They actually slept five people in her. Five people could sleep in her at the same time. Doris. It's ridiculous. There's like bunk beds in there and everything. It's not even funny. Yes, it's very funny actually. It's gonna be at the auto, auto show, right? Yeah, it's gonna be at the auto you show. You gonna let people sleep inside Doris? I am not sure about that actually. <laughs> Talking about the auto show. I, you know what? I tried. I tried to talk to Mr. Shaper and Miller the other day. So I went to that the office thing, right? And Mr. Shepard wasn't there. And uh, but, however, I saw Mr. Mueller in the hallway, and he saw me, and he he covered his face like this. <laughs> well, that's what I tried to do for a while, but it didn't work out so well. <laughs> All right then. <laughs> Next. <laughs> Don't, don't don't talk so close to the mic, cause you're what you're, what you're what what? what? Can, you, can you hear me? No. Can no. you talk can louder? You louder. <laughs> can you hear me? A little louder. A little louder. Like this? <laughs> yeah, that's good. Perfect. Right. Just talk like that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> wow, I'm falling asleep, Buddha. Do something interesting. Put something. Put some good music. What is that? <sighs> oh, that's the from the news. These microphones are not that great. It's not good at all, actually. No, you just don't know how to play guitar. That's true. Number what? Oh, it's number... Number... Prank. 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 Number prank. <laughs> I, I can play this. No. I'm a part-time lover and a full-time friend The monkey on the back is laid his track but anyone can see or anyone else but you come on so I forget the lyrics somebody somebody come on 
<laughs> does, any, does anybody know. know the lyrics of that song like after first first? No. Because I don't. Yeah, no, <laughs> that's what I thought. Let's let's make it up. <laughs> I'm a horse rider and uh, I like to. <laughs> do you do drugs? Milk out of the microphone. <laughs> and then I go to home and drink the milk and sleep well get, that uh, night. Yeah. Yes. You know what? I don't see what anyone can see, but anyone else but you. What a minute! I. What's the name of that song? It's called. Anyone else but you? Smart question. What a minute! Where's the paper? Thought I did. Where did it go? Son. Where's Son. It go? Oh. Son. What? I have it. Why is it? What is it? The song. Oh. Oh. It's weird. Let's do it. Alright, well, let me. Okay. Can you hear? Can you hear? Yes, I don't yeah. Have to. I don't have to. All right. You're a part-time lover and a full-time friend. The monkey on your back is the latest trend. You don't see what anyone else, what anyone else. But he is a church of the hills of steeple. We sure are cute. Sound of the running now people. I have no idea what this is. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, put the PSA. 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 In here. Passing gas in the company yes. of others is not only taboo, it can be deadly. <laughs> I'm gagging. Passing gas releases a plume of toxic vapors like ammonia and hydrogen cyanide. Oh, you're killing us over here. Daddy, you promised you'd smoke outside. You're right, pumpkin. Excuse me. If you're you right, smoke, pumpkin. Take it outside. Don't pass gas. A message from the American Legacy Foundation and the Ad Council. Get the facts at don'tpassgas.org.